Welcome to Rogue Babble, I'm Dustin, and today is Vlogmas Day 7. Now I hope you're as excited as I am about today's video. We are talking about Disney's A Muppet's Christmas Carol. Now The Muppet's Christmas Carol is just one of those things that I can't go the holidays without watching. Uh, I'm not sure if it is uh, Michael Caine's fantastic portrayal of Ebenezer Scrooge. It is a callback to my childhood, but yet every year I still get teary-eyed watching the story because it is so beautifully well done. And maybe it's because Tiny Tim is just a little more of a sad character when he's played by you know, a little froggy. Brian Henson does a fantastic job paying homage to his father because this is one of the first films that Jim Henson didn't actually uh, direct. The one other thing that I really enjoy about The Muppets Christmas Carol is the music in it. There are some really fun songs, some very emotional songs in it. Um, I love the Marley and Marley song. There's a really nice balance between the craziness that is the Muppets and the quasi-serious um, source material it is so Muppety, but at the same time being a very good adaptation of A Christmas Carol. I like that the integration of Muppets and human characters is so seamless. And I love the choices in casting the Muppets in the particular roles. We get to see Gonzo playing Charles Dickens. You've got Rizzo the Rat. It made sense 100% to have Kermit as Bob Cratchit and Miss Piggy as Mrs. Cratchit. The one casting choice that I loved the most was not just bringing back one of the Marleys, but bringing back Marley and Marley, played by Stadler and Waldorf. I also love uh, Sam the Eagle when he portrays Scrooge's headmaster. The scene with Sam the Eagle is one of my favorite moments because you have Sam the Eagle who is America personified and so very proud to be American and in that one little second you see him break his character he mentions that it is the American way and Gonzo goes over and whispers in his ear and he goes it is the British way. Um, the ghosts that they pick, oh my goodness, can we talk about the ghost of Christmas Future? Even as an adult, that puppet scares the bejeebus out of me. It is just so well done. I love the ghost of Christmas Present. He is just so warm and fuzzy. That is pretty well everything that I wanted to say about The Muppets Christmas Carol. It is just so much fun and I hope that you enjoy it as much as I do. So from me to you, I hope your day is just tickety-boo. I'll see you soon.